Hey guys, what's up? Um, I am feeling really good. I just played basketball. I played 1v1 versus someone, and I kind of beat him 11 to 3. I wish I'm sure I recorded that because it, it, it was actually really good. The game was a lot better than it sounds because, like, really, you beat someone 11 to 3, anyways. Um, yeah. Top 5 scariest ghost sightings caught on video, so we'll see what this is. Some of this might be fake, I don't know. I don't really know if I believe it goes, but I've actually heard, heard some stories, and I do see, and I did see some videos that looks kind of convincing. I don't know. Anyways, let's check, the, let's check this out. Everyone, and welcome back to Top Five Central. Today, we're looking at the top five ghost sightings caught on video. Now today I'm very excited to announce I'm going to be doing a $100 Amazon gift card giveaway where all you have to do to enter is click the link in the description to do all the steps. You get like five different chances to enter and win so make sure you follow all the steps down below. I think we're going to have this giveaway be like a week or two long this time but if we could break 5,000 likes I'll have it last this entire month. Anyways with that said let's get right into it. Number 5. All hotels have stories about their guests doing crazy things, but what this hotel had to deal with was weirder than most. Security was called to a hotel in Illinois where screams were heard coming from a room, but it was discovered that no one had checked in to stay there. The room had to be empty, but the screams were still happening, and they scared people so much that the staff resorted to calling the police. If I hear something like What's that, worse is that when the security guard went inside, he found the room exactly. totally destroyed, but with no sign of who did it. The shower was running, the carpet was ripped up, and all the furniture was upside down. But the creepiest Ooh. thing of all happened when the guard walked away. As he leaves, you can see something sort of like glide out of the room and follow him down the hall, as if it's not happy to have been disturbed. It's true that the shadow could have just been a trick of the light, but it looks really human, and watching it silently follow him is kind of terrifying. Whatever it was and whatever it wanted, it was probably one guest the hotel would rather just forget. of ghosts made famous in horror movies, the ghosts of children's are always the most frightening. I mean, you can't really blame this guy for freaking out when he came face to face with one. In this clip from China, the guy is just riding along when he almost crashes into what looks like a young kid. The child is standing in the middle of the road with his hands up, and it looks for sure like he's gonna get hit. But just as the bike should have made contact, he vanishes into thin air. Understandably, the guy is really freaked out. He even got off his bike to look around as if he can't believe what just happened, but that's not the scariest bit. While he's staring at the place where the kid should be, he reappears again, this time looking straight at the bike with what looks like an arm in the air. The biker does exactly what any other sensible person would have done in that situation, and he runs away. Even leaving behind his bike in his panic. What's crazy is the child is already gone. One thing's for sure, it might make him rethink riding down dark roads in the future. I see it! Oh my god! Is it reappearing again? Yeah, I saw it. I saw it. Dude, that's so freaky. Oh my god. Again, some of this might be fake. I don't, I don't really know. Number three. But then again, some of this. Traffic in Mexico City can get pretty crazy at times, but this might be the first time it's gotten truly supernatural. It seems like a normal intersection at first, until the figure of a woman appears just in front of a passing car. The girl is dressed in white and has long dark hair, and doesn't even flinch when the car goes straight through her. One news site declared that the footage was promotion for a Day of the Dead celebration, but many more seem to think that the woman is the spirit of La Llorona. Okay, I totally pronounced that wrong, but apparently she's a legendary ghost who drowned both her children and herself when she learned her husband had left her for his younger lover. When she reached heaven, she was told she couldn't enter until her children were found, and now she's cursed to wander the earth until she finds them again. Whether it's her or not, I can't say, but the footage is still chilling, especially the way she just stares at the car as it speeds towards her. That driver's probably going to drive a lot more carefully from now on if he's brave enough to drive at all.
Number two. On the list of scariest places to see a ghost, hospitals and asylums are always at the top because so many shady things might have happened there in the past. This hospital in Honduras is no different because apparently had a doctor that killed himself in the building and a spirit hasn't wanted to leave since. The footage is pretty simple, but you can see the shadow of the doctor step out from behind the door at the end of a corridor. It basically hovers there between the stretchers. Apparently, this ghost spends the rest of his time turning the lights on and off in rooms where patients are staying, as though even though he's dead, he still feels the need to take care of the sick. After this story came to light, hundreds of people attempted to go there and find the ghost at the hospital, which led to staff trying to get the footage taken down. However, even though plenty of people feel brave enough to go and hunt the ghostly doctor down, seeing him appear and disappear suddenly is really terrifying. What would you do? Would you go looking for trouble or stay well away? Let me know in the comments down below. Like if, I, if I find out there's a, there's a ghost in this house, I'm not even out for like any of that shit. Now of all the sightings on this list, catching a ghost in a cemetery seems to make the most sense. Because that's probably where you think most spirits would be hanging out. As well as that, when you're in the most haunted city in America, you can't be surprised to catch one on video. Jesse accidentally stumbled on a ghost in a cemetery in Savannah, Georgia. His strange behavior left him really freaked out. The figure is blurry and really far away, but it looks like the figure of a child supposedly chasing a woman through the graves. It stops just long enough to leap onto a tree that's nearby, but when it drops down from the branches, it completely vanishes. The video failed to convince a lot of skeptics, but Jesse has maintained a stance that it couldn't be fake, as he borrowed the camera and barely even knew how to use it. Also, the video is from way back in 2008, when editing software was a much less advanced thing, so doctoring the footage would be even harder. Either way, the encounter itself is pretty terrifying, making the video more than worthy of a place on this list. He says a child running after a shadowy woman. Couldn't even see her face, so I, I just focus on this kid. I think a ghost child is more terrifying than a ghost. He says the figure suddenly jumped onto a tree. Moments later, it dropped and disappeared. Uh, hold on. I was stunned, for sure. Many people have tried to prove ghosts exist using all sorts of technology. The problem with technology is it can be manipulated. But Jesse says he didn't do any of that. He had a basic camera that he could barely operate. Was it faked? No. I don't know anybody that can make it look as real as it does. Back home in Akron, Jesse's family watched it repeatedly. And there's our video on the top five ghost sightings caught on camera. If you enjoyed the video, please feel free to leave a like down below and subscribe so you see whenever we upload a video. All right. Yeah, that was pretty terrifying. Some of this might be fake, but some of this might be fake, but then again, some might not be. I, I, I don't, I don't really have any way to know. Anyways, yeah, be sure to drop a like, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye.